we bypass live working method in the most difficult and complicated technology in the live working of distribution network. Building the bypass system equipment, the load current of the line to be repaired is transferred temporarily by live working, and the line to be repaired is insulated and shut down. It ensures that the users at the back end of the line can use electricity normally and without power outage. At present, the bypass cable laying method mainly adopts the ground laying method. Generally, if the cable and its connecting device are dragged manually on the ground for a long time, these components will directly bear the tension, which will cause insulation damage to the cable and joint. If the working line encounters a road intersection and a main channel, the vehicle will be rolled to the cable when it passes, causing serious damage to the insulation layer on the cable surface. Under normal circumstances, a reliable cable guard slot must be used and a special person must be set up to take care of it. In addition, due to complex road traffic, budget mountain roads, crossing roads, construction obstacles and other factors, it is very difficult to achieve normal cable laying. The device we developed is suitable for all bypass operation set environments. It mainly includes four parts, support system, traction system, hanging cable mechanism, and auxiliary safety system. We have independently developed new devices, such as two-wheel rope hoist, two-wheel rope holder, two-wheel cable hoist, cable cross arm and tractor. Only one traction rope is needed to host all two-wheel cable hoist and cables, and the cable is not cooled. The bypass cable can be laid overhead to achieve very free laying of the bypass cable. At present, a total of 12 patents have been applied for this device, including 5 invention patents, 7 utility model patents, and 2 technical papers. And the device was displayed at the 7th China Live Working Technology Conference. The use of this device has expanded the scope of bypass operation, reduced the demand for the number of staff in bypass operation, lowered the labor cost, avoided the wear problem in contact with the ground, and protected the insulation performance of bypass equipment. The system device is simple to operate, safe and reliable. According to the practical application, the average time of bypass operation is reduced from 8 hours to 5 hours, which can improve the work efficiency. The operation is simple, safe and reliable, and has a very good application prospect in the bypass maintenance operation.